guys, welcome back to another episode of No Man's Sky. So, I'm just writing, refining up some uh, concentrated carbon. This is basically the recipe that you get. So, for two oxygen and one concentrated carbon, you get six um, concentrated carbon in back. So, basically, you double, if not triple the amount, uh, because concentrated carbon is actually more than carbon. So, if you were to, like just use oxygen you would just get carbon and if you just used concentrated you carbon you would just get carbon but if you were to combine the two you get concentrated carbon so it might even be triple um the amount that you get back i'm not entirely sure but um you do get double the amount of the resources from what it costs to actually manufacture it so um, because there's only three re items required, you get six back in total. So it's, it's a pretty, pretty good deal uh, when you take it in consideration. And it only costs uh, 40 concentrated carbon to power the oxygen um, harvester. So it, it's actually a really good uh, deal because you get so much more from the oxygen you just produced. Um, like, this is from the oxygen that I produced last night. I put some concentrated carbon in it last night, and I'm just... already got, like, two... Like, 500, I think? 504. So that's how much I've already gotten back from what there was. And there's a little bit more left in here that I'll be able to combine it. Now, if I were to take out the uh, 250 concentrated carbon that I put in, I would still be making a lot of profit from the uh, concentrated carbon. Well, not profit, but, like, amount of um, concentrated carbon, so. But, uh, yeah, outside of that, I want to um, maybe discover another planet today, and we'll see if we can. Uh, I think there was a system that we could explore that was... Um, something like a lush planet or something like that. I'll have to take a look into it. But, um... We'll check that out in a little bit and s see what kind of systems we have. Alright, so I'm going to put... 40 that and recharge that um, oxygen harvester. And... Then we can get a move on. So I'm just going to put that in there. And that charges it up 200%, and then we get 250 from that. Alright. So let's go to our ship, and we will go ahead and just make sure that we have oxygen on us. Uh, uh, yeah, we have a fair amount. Thank you. 
Alright, so this planet was pretty easy to find all the creatures on. Um, it's in our same solar system as our base. If we go to the um, thing I've discovered all eight, so we get a total of 2,000 nanites, which is good. Plus the um, additional ones that we get for um, discovering each individual one. Uh, I found seven rocks, uh, minerals in the location that I landed. So, couldn't find any more. I wasn't. Uh, I looked a little while, but the uh, radiation was um, kind of hard to deal with. It was going down pr quite quickly. Not like totally like fast, but you know, fast enough where I had to recharge a couple times. But uh, we did get 70, 79. That's not too bad. And then the 2000 from actually discovering all the uh, creatures. So. Pretty good. All right, so there's one more planet in the system that I want to check out, and we'll see if we can't find it. We, by the looks of it, discovered five planets all for um, all the creatures and stuff. So we'll go out to space, and we'll see if we can't locate this um, planet or moon that is supposedly um, still around. So. Okay, so that's that current planet. Says there's... Oh, there it is right there. Pretty sure that's it. It is... Yep. Um, ancient, Endless, Morus. Morus? Morus? I don't know what that means, but there's uh, low sentinel, sentinel activity on it, so... Should be good to explore it pretty far away it doesn't say that it's moon so and there's ancient bones I vaguely remember those being um, pretty valuable if you dig them up too though I don't know if what kind of world this is it says facium so I'm assuming a swamp maybe I don't really have too much to go on other than copper and cobalt which is Pretty much any planet can have it. We're gonna have a battle in a couple seconds too. There's a uh, radar on the screen right there, popping up. Probably should slow down. Yeah, sure. You don't mean to me any harm. Two thousand? No, oh, that's really cheap. But no. We'll see how much we get from this. Alright, so I got all the creatures on that planet discovered. There was a couple fish and um, quite a few land creatures. So we got all those discovered. We got like, I think it was about 2,500. I'm not sure. It was uh, over 2,000 for sure. Uh, discoveries. Let's just double check. Oh, it doesn't say, does it? 
<clears throat> I think it was like 2,500. I'm not sure. It wasn't too much more than what we discovered on the other planet, but, you know, it was, it was still a fair amount. But, um, the next thing that I want to do is, um, do a trade route. Oh, what's this? Ah, uh, I think this has to do with the pirate missions, actually. We can't actually claim that ship, unfortunately. I tried already on <laughs> my other save. But, um, yeah, it's actually another anomaly? Whoa. I don't know what this is. Oh, I see. Nice, we got actually something from it. Uh, fossil... Tortoise something or other. It's worth quite a bit, actually. Okay, so we're on our way to the uh, space anomaly because... Or not space anomaly, the space station, so we can... Do some stuff though. Trading. Yeah, we might be able to do some stuff there. Um, oh, there it is. Apparently, <laughs> right in front of us. That's why you should be paying attention while driving. While flying, I guess. Yeah, we could probably get some uh, good money from that, I think. Okay. Just fill that up. I wouldn't mind getting some more of um, that fuel. Let's see if we can't get some fuel from there, from the station. Uh, what kind of guild is this? Fighters Guild. We should be able. To So we got quite a bit of stuff done today. I've been trying to find one part for our multi-tool. I ended up purchasing a class A multi-tool. It's a rifle and um, came with a blaze javelin or something like that. But 
uh, gives us a lot more room to improve our um, our scanning and stuff like that so we can make even more money but uh, I'm, I'm trying to put together the surveying device but I need a quantum computer which can usually be bought at the stations um, from the ships that come in but <laughs> they're um, I haven't had any luck with uh, getting the um, quantum computer so I'm just like sitting here and I keep feeling these tremors every once in a while I'm not sure where it's coming from if it's related to the sh space station maybe it has to do with that maybe it has to do with that oh yeah it has to do with that for sure okay uh, I thought it was like uh, shuttles or something like um, the station being attacked at first but I never really noticed it until now so yeah it's definitely the um, thing going there it seems to charge or whatever but outside of that if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe comment down below rate the video and I will see you guys next time thanks for watching peace out